Wait. Let's get that up inside us. There we go. Because where we're going today, I'm probably going to need that broken bone buff. Oh, look at that. There with the birds. Oh, that shot. Then we've got the smoke in the background too. I'm going to explain this in a second, guys. But I should say, <laughs> welcome back, everyone, to another beautiful day in the jungle. Welcome back to Ancestors. I should also say, Happy New Year. You're probably sick to death of hearing that by now. But Happy New Year. Welcome to 2023. I wish you all the success, and I really do mean this. I wish you all the best health for you and your family members in the upcoming year. So, I've done a little bit of off-screen stuff, as you could probably tell. I couldn't help myself, guys. As you know by now, I'm massively obsessed. So, I went that way, and I discovered whatever that is over there, which was called the Great Lake. There wasn't really anything too much to see. It's what you would expect. Down there, I think, yeah, this was where the rivers meet. So, this was just like an, an intersection of rivers. Although... This area over here, you see that massive tree? <laughs> it's called the Father Tree. And I wanted to get to the top of that so I could get, like, a uh, perspective of what you would get in something like Assassin's Creed right from the very top and look out over everything because this area looks amazing. Once I discovered it, a couple more meteors came in, and that's, I think, what the smoke is coming from. So we've got to do a bit of adventuring and find out what that is. But what I wanted to do today, because I have had some feedback from you guys, and I did ask in the previous episode if there was a specific area where we could go. There was kind of mixed comments on that. The first thing people were saying was different areas are advantageous or kind of a really thing you should watch out for if you're moving the clan. Because certain areas are good, certain areas are bad, but they all have their ups and downs, I guess is what I'm trying to say. There wasn't really one clear area where I could take the uh, the group and just be comfortable, <laughs> I guess. Unless I just haven't come across that comment yet. Also, you guys have been talking to me a lot about the reinforcements. Now, if I'm misunderstanding this right from the way you guys have explained it, I believe the reinforcements that we get correlate to how many kids that we have. And you can lock in the neural pathways that you've locked when you evolve. So I think we're going to do that today because I'm interested to find out what goes on with that. So here's what we got to do. I've got to find my way back to the settlement all the way back over there because I believe if I just pick this as the new settlement, I'm going to lose the clan. And I don't want to do that. I don't want to risk that. So I'm going to go back and I think it will be cool as well to travel through the jungle with my clan. I think it'd be so sick. And then we're going to make our way down here, the massively epic journey. And then if we have time... I'm going to go and discover what these are over here, the new meteors, and then find out what we can gain from that. All else failing, we are going to try and evolve, which I believe is going to kind of skip ahead of time like we've seen with the pregnancies, but I'm not too worried about it. I am going to be heartbroken if we see any of our clan members die because you guys have said, don't get attached to the apes. It's too late. <laughs> I can't help myself. So that's what we're going to do. I am getting a bit worried about Ooh as well. Because his vitality is getting kind of low. So, yeah, we're going to head back. I'm probably going to switch up the character too. So, let's start that right away. Where's the uh, where's the sticks I already made? I think I got a couple over here. I also realized that in that last episode that I don't need to always sharpen them. I can still impale, like, the uh, the kitties or I can impale the snakes and stuff. Or the, uh, the piggies if they come too close. So, as long as I've got this, I should. I say that. I should be golden. But yeah, we're going to make the massively epic journey all the way back now, which should be that one there. Yeah, there we go. And as far as I can see, so far, that is by far the best place. And I know you guys have said you don't need to do all the things, the prompts that are coming up on the screen, this stuff. You don't need to do that, but I kind of want to. Because if there's anything that's going to stick with me, it'll be by doing that. So, yeah, it's the best way I'm going to learn. And I'm having a blast with it, so why not? How do we get up there? I've learned the hard way off camera not to climb sheer rock faces. Because, a little bit of a spoiler here, I did climb that side wall to see if I could get to the top. And I could get, like, almost to the top. I couldn't get all the way up there. But my stamina bar was pretty much depleted, and I was in the red. So I had to kind of rest on the edge. It looked kind of jank. And then get my stamina back and then keep climbing. So, yeah, I don't want to keep doing that. Look at that. Look at my stamina. This is kind of what I had to do. I had to find like a flat area, like this one, and just get my stamina back. But look how small that is now. Climbing like sheer rock faces, which, <laughs> I mean, you would imagine that is bad. 
Let's get over here. We'll get ourselves a stick for the journey on the way back. I think we are going to be traveling at night time too, but that's okay. Because I'm pretty confident that we know where we're going. Oh, wait. There's a... There's definitely a... I want to call it a maker. Makerados or whatever they're called. There's another snake over there. Look. They're literally everywhere down this side. That's the only bad side about that. When I bring the clan through, I'm going to have to see if I can intimidate them in numbers, if that works. One thing I am so happy about is the fact that when I went through this cave, there was no spiders. Like, some of you guys, I think some of you guys were trying to freak me out with that earlier on. Like, oh, wait till you see what's further down the line. And I was like, that's always pointing to something with a spider because you guys know that by now. Give me this. Yeah, grub out. Come on. But yeah, as soon as I saw that, like, my stomach did a backflip. The first time we came across it anyway. I should probably grab them for a snack on the way home too, but I'm going to leave it. And we're going to take to the trees. I'm going to try and get that swing in motion down. Really cool area, but yeah, the, the cat completely put me off this. Even though in numbers I could probably keep it away. Strength in numbers kind of thing, but yeah, I don't know. It's not calling to me like the other places. Go on, get up there. Ooh, there's a nest. Ooh, there's two nests. Easy does it. And where are we going? We're going... I just want to get kind of get out of this area. There we go. Over there. That works. Ooh. I first had this thought as well a while back when I was swinging through the trees. If it rains and we slip off the tree, I would hate that. I'm so glad that isn't a thing in this. It probably should be. Because I imagine trees, when they're soaked through like this, would be so hard to grip. Having said that, like the grip of an ape, I think that's a totally different thing than what I'm thinking of. But yeah, I'm, I'm glad that's not a thing where I have to worry about that if it is raining. All right, let's get back this way. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we're good, we're good. <gasps> it's so easy to kind of lose track of where you are, which way you're swinging. Let's get back up there. Should probably lock the uh, the settlement in too. Yeah, let's do that. Settlement. Remember, let's get back all the way over there. You can see just how far away it is. What? What have we got? Something's hunting me. It's probably a rock python. Yeah, there we go. Look. Intimidate. There was a few of you guys telling me to try and take down one of the crocodiles. Now, <laughs> stupid as that sounds, I was actually thinking about it. Because I want to see all the animations, but I also don't want to lose our ape. Like, I really don't want to. And again, I know you guys have said don't get attached. But I want to try and keep him alive as long as possible. I want to try and survive, right? You want to do that. I don't just want to just blindlessly go running into death. But having said that, I do want to see the animations. Because the animal interactions in this are so cool. The pythons constricting around the, uh, the giant predator cats and stuff. Oh, he's so well done. I want to see all of it. And I'm sure we're going to run into more animals as well the, the f further along the evolutionary chain that we get. Even the one with the bird at the beginning that took out the elder is so, so cool. Absolutely horrific, but it was cool. Right, we're not too far away. We're using the height in the trees too. This is where it scares me though, because I feel like I'm safe here. Ooh. I feel like I'm safe here. Easy does it. Easy does it. Oh, okay. That was quite a heavy landing. We stuck it though. Over there. Can we make that? Yeah, we can. Still second guessing. Still not 100% comfortable. But yeah, I'll swing for like these bushes or these leaves here. Try and grab them and I'll just miss. Like one in five, I will just miss. <laughs> not today. Okay, we're good. No! Oh, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. It is a guessing game a lot of the time in hopes that you will just grab it, but we're making good progress. Almost there. And then every now and again, the music will just chime in just to calm you down a little bit. And you shouldn't be calm. You should always be on edge. Like, you really should. <laughs> Over this way. Let's get some more height. Yeah, I'm recognizing this area now. I think if you curl around to the left, this is where we're going to see the... Uh, the arches over on the right-hand side. The twin arches. Let's get over there. Oh. If there was some kind of way that there was a chance your ape could slip off 
That would be so cruel. <laughs> it really would. When it does that heavy impact from, from a high drop. I would not like that. Yeah, we're good. I recognize this area now. Two o'clock in the morning. It was a long trip, but we made it back. All our buffs are gone. We're calm. The music and the surroundings are beautiful. Big smile on my face. And we're going to be moving the clan in the morning. Right, nice. Okay. Right, who we got here? Ah, and that's Seg's mum. Kiyu. Lutz. Okay, switch. Alright, there we go. That's way better. And I'm going to... You know what? I'm going to actually drop this. I might leave it here. At least I know where the stones will be if I need them. So we got the kids there. Who are you again? You're M. And that's an elder, La. Oh, no. I think La. Your time's going to be coming soon once we evolve. And... Ooh, you should be doing better than with your health and stuff. So we got Kek. <laughs> you guys love that name. We've got Na and Seg, it should be. Unless it's a different one I've not seen yet. Yeah, there we go. There's Seg and Q. Right, who's over here then? There's a couple that are just like kind of by themselves. This is an elder. Looks really cool as well. And you are Ben. Okay. And who's over there? You are... Oh, Kodge. Okay, yeah. Perfect. This ape is my spirit animal. Look, he's just dreaming about food. <laughs> I've always liked you, Lutz. Right, so food, water, sleep. Four o'clock in the morning. Look at everybody having a lie-in. Stop it. Everybody wake up. We've got a big day ahead of us. I've actually given a lot of them sticks, which I probably shouldn't have because I want to see if the, uh, like the group thing works, the mimic. Let's just scoop up a load of this water because this is the last time we're ever going to be at the base of this waterfall. I think at least. We are going to be changing where we live. I'm actually going to grab that as well. Just going to grub out some breakfast. Some horsetail. Why not? Get it down, you lud. Nice. And that one is the, uh, the buff that helps the broken bones. Okay, so I think we're about ready to go. I'm, I'm a bit scared. I don't mind telling you guys. I don't want to lose all the... Uh... Oh, did you hear the babies? Oh, the little scream that they do. All right, I'm going to switch to the elder real quick. And piggyback. Piggyback. Right, can I... Analyze. Switch to ooh. And then I'm going to piggyback. So that's the other one. I don't think there's any more babies. Who are you? Look, you. I don't know if it's the best idea having them with an elder, but that, it might be smarter to do that. Where's Luck gone? Is you? Right, can I switch back to Luck? Because that's who's going to be leading the expedition. And then we're going to pick the two little ones up. Piggyback. And... Wait, can we not get the other one? Piggyback. There we go. And I'm going to pick this stick up. All right, guys. Let's go. We're heading out. Oh, my God. My entire clan are about to head over to a settlement that they know nothing about. They're putting all their trust in me. Oh, they're coming. Oh, I'm all scared. Right, hold on. Let me switch to this one for a second. No, it's not that one. I think it's a little bit further down, but I think that's the one that we're going to have to head to. Wait, is it that one? It could be. No, Little Swamp. No, it's, I'm going to head over towards that way. And then we're going to go from there. All right. Let's go. Over to the tree. Oh, I want to see what they do when I do this. Whoa. What? Oh, they just dropped down. Okay, so they'll find their own way around. All right, that's good to know. I'm just going to keep it moving then. Hopefully, they'll stay, like, somewhat close to me. That'd be, like, the, the perfect thing. I'm going to try and stay among the trees as much as I can. I guess the, the, the thing that I should just be doing, because I've done the clan call now, I should just assume that they're going to follow. If I just keep waiting for them, somebody's going to straggle behind, and I'm going to get everybody killed. So, <laughs> I'm just going to keep going this way. We're going to take to the trees, like this one here, and we're just going to get some height. Please be following. 
Are you behind me? Okay, yeah, they are. Oh, I'm so happy to see this. I think I can see it in the lower right corner, too. I think everybody is with me here. The two on the bottom right there of the screen are the infants that I have. And everybody else is attached to me. I think that's the way it works. I've been trying to work that out since the very start. What was that? Oh my god, I swear I can hear one of them asking for something. Listen. I don't know what they're asking for, but I, I'm, we're going to go down to the water here. And we're going to have a drink actually by the river, though, not near the actual swamp. Because you know there's a crocodile waiting to get all of them. So I'm going to get in this and leave your stick here a second. Leave that there. Right, come on. Come and get a drink. Oh, that's so cool. Come on, drink. Come on, everyone. Get something to drink. Yes, that's perfect. I can see some of them are a little bit hungry too. We've got some food over here that you guys can have. Yeah, look at that. They're all starving. All right. Let me pick this one back up. Wait, can we get my stick? There we go. This is going to be tricky doing this. This is why I wanted you guys to be here for it. I could have easily done this away from camera, but I wanted you guys to see exactly what was happening. Right, order mimic. And I guess I'm going to grab one of these and then eat. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow, they picked this place clean. Oh, yeah, look at that. Like, <laughs> it's all gone. Got a little bit of a buff. Okay, maybe that's like a little quick pit stop. Let's go. Come on. We gotta go. Oh, I love this. It's so scary at the same time because I know a lot of you guys are thinking the same thing. Which one of them is going to die first? Because <laughs> I know it's going to happen. I know I'm going to see like a cutscene where uh, the rock python is just going to wrap around one of them. I'm hoping it's just not one with the babies. I really don't want that. It's not like any of them are better than the rest. It's just that I don't want one to get caught with the kids. That would be horrible. Absolutely horrific. The snake will get one hell of a meal, but yeah, if it's a straggler or something, then I mean, I guess it happens. It's part of survival. Let's get over here. Right, I think we can somewhat stick to the trees now. That's a big old tree there. Has it got a way across? Right, swing. You gotta find your way across, guys. I can't hold your hand through this. You gotta learn. Part and part of survival. Over this way. So this is the first checkpoint. I right, can go from here. And then we can go there like this. Oh, I saw one swinging. Oh, love that. Get over there. And then, just, wait, wait, wait. Let's have a little break. I swear I can hear one of them talking, guys. I know I keep saying it. But it sounds like they're saying ghost or something. Or go. Or it might be a word for like hungry or something. Really trippy, whatever it is. I'm right, gonna get to the top of this tree and then over there, over this side. Come on, we can make that. Oh, yeah, we're making good progress here. We're staying off the ground. Everybody should be safe, I think. Making good time. Plenty of daylight left. We shouldn't be too far out from where I want to get us either. I'm just hoping they like it, you know? <laughs> and if they get there, like, this is shit. <laughs> I want to go back. <laughs> you know what? Find your own way. Because I ain't taking you. I organized this bitch. And you don't appreciate? You find your own way home. Oh, okay, right. This is where it's going to get dicey. Because this is where the, uh, the scary stuff was. Let me just do this. Go over there. What's that one? Wait, can we focus? I don't think that's it. I think I've just heard a crocodile underneath. Enclosed waterfall. Two rivers junction. Wait, is it that? That's the one. Right. Memorize. We found it. Are they walking behind me as well? I know a few of you guys have been asking for this, by the way. Like, going across, just traversing through the trees, like, journeying through it and stuff. <laughs> you really like it. I like it too. I'm doing it with the, uh, the group of the... <gasps> Wait, that's one of ours, right? Yeah, that's the elder. I thought that was just a rogue one with just two babies. 
That could be cool, finding that. Like, you know, they've got into some some trouble and they're just hiding out with their uh, with their babies wrapped around them for dear life and then you can save them. Maybe it's a thing. Listen to that music as well. So well done. Over there. Yeah, the only thing that, like, throws me off- Oh, no, 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 no! Shit, 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 no, shit! Come on! Oh, red flower, red flower, red flower, that's what we need. Oh, God, my heart sank then. I thought that was gonna be it. I thought we were gonna- Oh, get up. I thought we were gonna squish him. Okay, we're gonna have to, like, suck it up for a minute because I can't be near that snake. That was almost- Exactly what I uh, I had planned for like the worst premonition. Over there, over there. Oh, there's the red flower. Grab it. Oh no no no! Go 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 go! Wait, I'm gonna have to turn around. Turn around, intimidate. No no, intimidate. No. Stop it. Yes. Oh yes, that's so good. He grabbed one of them as well. Come on. Right, grab this. Come on, we can just get a little bit more. Oh my god. I was just saying to you guys, that's what I was worried about. Come on. Let's go over this side and then we're, we're kind of in a good area. I should probably settle for this area here, but no. I, wa I want to go to the spot that I, uh, I had planned from the start. Let's get back up into the trees. I'm so wrecked here, guys. <laughs> You can probably hear it. Every now and again when I get super stressed, I can ba I can barely swallow. I thought that was a bird. It is, but it's not the, the predatory one. I like try and take a, a breath or I swallow and you can hear the fear. <laughs> My whole body just freaks out. <laughs> We're good though. I think so anyway. Let's get this way around. Just need to find an area where I can use the bushes to, to swing through. It's going to be this one, isn't it? Yep. And then maybe get to the top of that. And then straight across. It should be a straight shot now. Okay, so we had a really sweaty moment where, <laughs> where one of them did get coiled up. But we uh, we intimidated it. I'm proud of us for that. Over there. I don't know if I made a note of everybody's names, but if anybody's lost, you know what? I'm not going back for him. I've done enough. I'm stressed. Stop. Stop. Just take a breather. Okay, I had a slight fall, as you can see. Got a couple of broken bones. I got a little bit of this. And we should be healing pretty quick. I'm not... Yeah, I don't need to do that right. Just drop that. Switch the hand for this one. We're making good progress still. So I'm happy about that. Let's get over this side. We're so, so close now. We are so, so close. And then it should just be over these last couple of trees. Oh, let's eat this. Wait, can I mimic doing this? Mimic order. You guys doing the same thing? Just having a little snack. One more bite should do it. Or two more bites. Forget sometimes that when these fruits are picked up, there's quite a lot on them. We're good. And we got to get down here somehow. I've got a feeling there's a cat here. There has to be. There's no way it goes this smooth all the way across to the spot where we're trying to get to. I say smooth. I've fallen and broken my legs twice, and there's been a snake. But otherwise, I think it could have gone a lot worse. We're good, we're good, we're good. Wait, what did I have in my hand there? Did I have another stick? I didn't know I could do that. Wait, can I hold two sticks? Can I dual wield sticks? Give me that. Alter. Drop. There is no way. Oh my god, I can. I can dual wield the sticks. I <laughs> didn't know you could do that. Right, drop to here. Over this side. And here we go. Right, can I make this my new settlement? Let's get everybody down. If I can mimic them drinking in this spot, maybe that'll give me the... Oh, listen to the music. I already made some beds, so... Settle. Did we do it? The clan and a new settlement. Oh my god, we actually did it. And I think one of them is either injured or being attacked. But you know what? I got everybody here. 
Identify the jungle's father tree. We did that. Establish a new clan settlement for between two and three clan members. No way did we actually pull that off. Okay, well, the first thing we're doing is we're laying down and we're getting some sleep. Because it's been a long, long day getting from A to B. Let's skip all this across. We're getting everything done. Look at that. Seven to nine clan members. I don't actually know how many we did there. It was quite a few. Oh, 10 to 12. Is that how many we managed to do? Okay. That's really good for us. Right, so we got a new settlement at least. And can I tell you to wait here now? No. Okay, everyone is just chilling in their new home. Where's the kids though? Are they... I don't see any of the babies. Okay, so I think it's about that time. I've just been checking in on all the uh, the clan members. They seem like they're all settled in. And this is, uh, this is definitely the new home. So if we go here, will that actually show as an active settlement? It's not showing that. Oh, wait, no, it is. It's showing it there. Okay, perfect. Yeah, look at them all. Why is that one red? Is it got to find food? I'm sure it'll figure it out on its own. But that's where we're heading to first. So let's stand up. Let's use our intelligence. That's where we're going to get to. And we're just going to follow it round as well. I have been in that area. I didn't see anything too dangerous. <laughs> Famous last words. But yeah, it's actually a really cool spot. So let's go back over there. Find out what's going on with the meteorite crash. Hopefully get some more of that brain juice. And then if nothing much is going on with that kind of stuff, we'll come back and we'll evolve. Because I think at this stage right now, I'm kind of comfortable with what's going on. When we start making evolutionary jumps... That's when it's going to put me out of my comfort zone again. I say that, I'm still freaking out over everything and anything. <laughs> I mean, in the last episode, there was a tree that moved. And I don't know if it was some kind of wildlife or anything like that, but it was enough to put me on edge. Like, <laughs> I was just waiting. Oh, you know what? For some reason, Lutz is always really, really hungry compared to Ooh. Yeah, look, still got that need. There we go. Satisfied it. But he's always, like, way more hungry compared to... Uh, to the other ape that I've been. Swing. Okay, water. We don't really want to mess around with this too much, so... Let's navigate this properly. I just don't want to get caught in that current and swept all the way down there. One, I don't know what's in the water, and two, I can't imagine Lut can swim very well. So, let's go over here and over this side. I mean, look at that shot, though. Oh, that's a cool shot! straight down the river all right we're up and over so this is officially the new area now oh look at that big old chunk of obsidian over there that's different i don't think that's just been like oh i guess it is next to the cliff i was gonna say the obsidian is usually found next to the cliff edges but we're right up against it now so it does make sense that it's being there this is a very very cool spot Kind of open, but still a very, very cool spot. We drop down there. Please tell me we can, because I'm going for it. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. And over this side. Nice, we made it across. So where do I need to get to here? Where's that smoke coming from? It's just around the corner. Keep your eye open for anything on the ground floor. Snakes, piggies, cats. Even some crocodiles that have wandered astray from the water. You know, you never know. You just never know. Ooh, what are you? What are you? What is that? Is that a pig? What is that? Yeah, that is a pig. Okay. There's two of them as well. Right, just... Hi. Oh, shit! Move! No! Oh, I timed it too early. No! And I dropped my stick! Get up there! Oh, you're a ri Oh, I've already got you before. Look at that. Where's my stick? Oh, my... No. Oh, okay, I didn't think you could get up here. Okay, I've got to go for the stick. i got to go for it. i got to take you out. You want a stick? All right, let's do this. Nice. Is he done? Oh, he's not done. Where are you going? He's retreating off. Right, give me another one. i got to find some of that fiber as well. Right, let's switch hands and strip. Right, we got to find some of that fiber. 
Okay, don't get annoyed. Don't get annoyed. Right. Let's inspect. It's another meteorite. Precious stone. We like them. Yep, there we go. Right, let's grab it. Oh, leave me alone, piggies, please. Flat Boulders Meteorite Site. Is that what this is called? New landmark discovery. Okay, so that's that one done. What have we got in the area here? Let me stand up. I know if we use smell, we might be able to find some food. What are you? Is that just telling me the pig? Okay, your sense of smell has increased, so we're smelling the pigs as well. What's that picking up on there? Oh, is it the horsetail? Okay, there we go. Oh my god! <gasps> Didn't even know the cat was in the area. Do we see the things hanging out the side of it while it's on top of the pig? You know what? I just had a second thought. If I come back to this area, I don't want that cat to be a problem. So I think we're going to try and take it down. It's resting right now, so I'm going to piss it off. There you are. I see what you're doing. You took down the pig. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Are you done? Oh, yes, you're done. Look at it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <gasps> Went right through the dome. Oh, he looks like Scar as well with the uh, the things above his... Well, the scars above his eyes. Oh, yes. Look at that. Inspect. Inspect the kill. That's what you get. I mean, I know you're only trying to eat, but... So cool looking. And there's the uh, the victim, the piggy that we saw before. We've already inspected that. I could have swore that you can take chunks off this. Maybe there still is a way of doing it, but... Yeah, I'm sure that's further down the line. All right. <laughs> Let's grab another stick. <laughs> Get this. Switch. And we're ready to go again. All right, we're going to head over to the other uh, meteorite. I know I need food as well. I'm going to find some of that on the way over there. Let's just keep it moving. We go that side. If there wasn't that maneuverability in the air as well, oh, it would be rough trying to navigate these trees. It really would. Okay, we should get a better... Oh, wow, look at this. I don't like what's going to be in that water, but this area looks amazing. Let's get across to the vines. Over there. And... Oh, is that hippos? <gasps> look at them absolute death tanks but so cool to see can i not stand up smell maybe yeah there we go okay I smell one doesn't know what it is how are we gonna get across have i got to swim to get across that no i think i can see a way around the other side over there so maybe traveling around that way and then yeah that's gonna lead me over that side maybe that side's gonna be the better bet Oh, I'm so glad that we got to see a new animal as well. I mean, make no mistake, those things are like, like I just called them, death tanks. They will annihilate anything in their path. Beautiful. Right, get the hell back over this way. Don't like being next to the water like that. And I see some rocks that maybe we can use. Ooh, okay, this is, oh, this is going to be so tricky getting across that. Do I want to go higher and try and get the one up there first? I just want to see. Oh, he's building my confidence. Oh! Get up, please! Oh, no! What have I done? Oh, no! No, no, no. Okay, this might not be that bad. We good? Oh, we're good. Oh, breathe. Breathe, ape. If I go that way, oh no, I may have screwed myself here. Oh no. Kids, I'm sorry in advance, okay? If we drown, it's on me. Ah, no. Come on. What is that bird? What are you? Oh, please grab onto something. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. Oh. Climb, climb, climb. Oh, that was such a sketch way, right? Can we just wait here for a second and get... No, we got to keep going. Come on, get up there. 
Oh, that was so incredibly sketchy. I did not need to take that risk. <laughs> I mean, at least you guys get to see what happens now. You get trapped in the water like that. Right, it's half seven at night, so we may as well just keep it moving. We can probably sleep on the island if I can find a rock or something just to get off the ground. Or maybe sleep now. Well, I've got the trees. Yeah, let's do that. We'll sleep now while I've got the trees around me and it's somewhat safe. <laughs> All right, got another area to conquer. Two here. Oh, we got a whole bunch of stuff. This should be good. Just hope it's not going to force me in the direction of that island over there because there's no way I'm going to be able to get across that without using that log. And in this site, it's so hard to see. One more should do it. Perfect. Oh, okay. It's forcing me that way. That's fine. Put the stick in this hand. Oh, I've got to go down there. Okay. I don't know if you can get attacked while you're trying to conquer. I imagine you can because this is kind of like the, the threat increased. Yeah, this is just us being scared, isn't it? It doesn't take away the uh, the bad <laughs> in the area. Conquer the fear of the unknown ten times. And we're right where we want to be too. Right, no more surprises now. Let's go across this. Over to that island. Discover that brand new meteorite. Ooh. Might have just been the rain, but I thought I heard like a, a gargle or something. Right, it's over this side. Can we climb this? Yeah, we can. This is really, really sketch though. Look at this. Over that side. Oh, grab it, please. Don't fall in that water. Oh, God, please don't do that. And then over there, you know what? If I take a little bit of damage here, that's fine. But I'm climbing right to the top of this bitch. And then, there we go. Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. And there's a big old crocodile there, which I don't know how I'm going to get past. But maybe I'm going to have to have a fight with one. I can't intimidate them. They're just, they don't give a shit. These are also armored death tanks with teeth. Let's go around this side. Oh, this is just Crocodile Island. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Quick. And inspect. Please. Oh, my God. Ape, why are you taking so long? Please. We got it. I know. I know. I'm gone. I'm gone. Island meteorite site. Yep, yeah, that's perfect. Okay, I'm sorry. Please leave me alone. Oh, God. They can be so fast on land, too. I know he turned around. Oh, he turned around. Okay. And then... Dodge! Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Get up there! Ah! Get up! Move! Yep, new wildlife! Come over to the pig! Oh, come over to the pig! Yes! Oh, that's so cool! He's got his leg! Oh, wow! He counted like a, a little head... Oh, oh! it came for me too. <gasps> Move. Okay, big crocodile killed giant warthog. We saw it. Was it worth it? Kind of. But we're out. That's all we came for. That's all we came to see. Never again. Goodbye, island forever. <laughs> Let's go up to this tree. Oh, please. Just get me there. Oh. Death. This whole island is death. Okay, this is really, really strange. So, we can either keep going around that way, which I don't think is going to gain us elevation actually saying that. It might do around the back. But down there, there's not really a way up. So, let me just see what happens if I go like this and then get some height this way. If I can just keep climbing it like this, even though I don't like doing it, I might be able just to get to the top. Or on the opposite side, maybe there's a clear way up, but... Oh, yeah, it might be that way. Oh, look at that. Oh, you see that? The cat just over there. I think this might be our best way then. Yeah, I think we're eventually going to have to climb up. What was that? I've just got to watch my stamina. Just got to keep on top of that. Just to make sure we're having uh, little short breaks like this right now. Recover that all the way up and climb, climb, climb. Stuff like this is what you need that stamina for. These big climbs like this now. Here we go. Go, go, go. We can do that. And this should be... Yeah, there we go. So there's one more, like, ledge that we need to navigate to get up there. 
And we can get ourselves a stick. Perfect. Something's telling me, though, this is a bit too easy, you know? <laughs> I feel like we're about to get into a bit of trouble. Twitch hands, alter, strip. Maybe climbing this tree. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Nothing is this straightforward with us. There's always a catch. So it's that side. Yeah, it's just over the top of that. If there's some water up here, that would be perfect as well. Okay, I think I see... Oh, look at that view in the background. Like desert area. Canyons, mountains. I'm sure we'll get there. I kind of don't want to leave the jungle, though. <laughs> I really, really like the jungle area of this. Get across. Oh, come on. Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, no broken bones. That's the main thing. I am as well. I'm going to be a little bit sad if we do the evolution and it just, like, goes massively far ahead. I want to do it in stages, which I'm hoping is what happens here. Not seeing any predators. Yes, we are. Okay, right. Let me intimidate you. Because I, I know I've done that in the past. Back up! Nice, we did it. You'd think that would give us a rush as well, right? Getting rid of a massive green mamba like that. Give us that big old dopamine hit. Alright, we've got to discover a load of stuff. That's fine. Stay on the rock so it's hard for any predator to navigate through them. And what we got over there? A rock that we can lift. Oh, is that a cave? Might be. Just under the uh, under yeah, hiding spot. Is he going to be happy with it? Oh, yeah. He's doing a little dance. New landmark discovered. Might take this back as well. We conquered a pretty big mountain coming up here. You guys imagine just eating a snail just like that? Like... <laughs> I know there's going to be someone that tells me as well, Fooster is delicious. I do it all the time. Oh... Oh, wait, no way did I just smack it with a rock. Oh, yeah, I want to keep doing that. No way. I actually beat the shit out of the cat with the meteorite because I didn't have the, uh, the stick in my right hand, which is apparently my attack hand. So, obviously, I mean, I knew anyway because you guys let me know, but that, that kind of... Shows the right hand is the one to keep everything in that you want to use. That was so cool. I thought I was in trouble there as well. What have you guys been doing since I've been away? I just got back and it said clan member dead. Who died? Oh, there was one on like the, the, the thing on the bottom right that had red next to it. Maybe it was injured or something and it needed my help. Oh, I should I kind of should have taken care of that before I left, to be honest. But I was too interested in going out adventuring. Right, let me drop the, uh, the meteor right there so I know where it is. I can actually drop this there too. We should be in the safety of the, uh, of the camp now. All right, so seeing as though we're back home. Oh, I'm a little bit upset that one of them died. I thought we were going to keep them all alive. Actually, there is also something else that I wanted to try, which is building more than a bed. A few of you guys have been talking about that, but I guess we'll do that later on. Let's lay down. Evolution. And we've got all these points again. All right, what else we got? Wait, what's that? Startle response. The preparation speed for a counterattack is maximized. Maybe I got that by smacking the, uh, the cat in the face. Oh, we get loads of stuff here. Look at this. Deep sleep. When sleeping in a sleep spot... Less time is needed to fully recover. Okay, that's a good one. Time difference, the range of detection sound. Okay, good. More sound stuff. Oh, we're unlocking everything. Evaluation speed. Okay, that's going to have to be the first one. Oh, it does them like a tree. Oh, so, oh, so the further out you go, it has to unlock the one before that as well. Okay, good to know. Odor is increased. Yeah, I think, again, this one is really, really useful, isn't it? Yeah, let's get that one, and then maybe... Like, what else can we use for that? The sound stuff? Oh, yeah, yeah, I should get that. Yeah, the sound stuff is going to be useful. So they're all locked in now. 
The neurons that have not been reinforced will lose their energy and will have to be refilled. Okay, so we don't lose them. I just need to refill them. Okay, I'm happy about that. That's fine. All unborn babies will be lost. That's fine. I don't think anybody's pregnant. Do you want to pass a generation now? Oh my god! Okay, so this is it. So I think we're gonna... Oh wait, no, no, no. Just before we go. Oh, I shouldn't get attached. I really shouldn't, but I want to know the names. I want to remember them. This is like the first generation of who we've got. We've got M. We've... Oh, there's the dead one! Oh! Codge. Oh no! Analyzing the corpse of a friend generates neural energy. As for other actions, you... Oh no, that's so sad. It was App. Wait, App was an old one though, right? Dead for zero years. Can we... I thought we'd be able to get rid of that. Are you sad? Ban. I think App was one of the older ones. It might have been the male that we really didn't like kind of adventure with, but... You. La. Oh no. So this is like the generation one group. Yeah, we're just going to go for it. All right, lie down. And evolution. All right, so we're about ready to go. The only thing that I did, because when I came back into this, it reset everything. I've just changed up a little bit for the reaction speeds when a predator comes across, because I think I might need them. So here we go. What's happening? Oh, they're growing up. Look at that. You can see that. The baby became an adult. Are we changed? 15 years? A kid with a genetic mutation has fully grown up. If this adult stays alive, the singular genetic potential will be effective. Wait, what did that say? Crap, I wanted to see that. So... Baby with spontaneous genetic mutation. Who is that? And who are we? Are we an elder now? I need to find all of these answers out right now. Who are you? You Oh, you're Seg! Mother was App. Oh, App was the one who died. Father was who? So they'll be elders now. Genetic mutation revealed. Settlement. What? Oh, you was a baby as well. So you've grown up. 15 now. Oh, that's so cool. Metabolism is locked in as well. Codge, coupled with... Ooh. Oh, Codge is in an elder now. Oh, we are. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we're an elder. I can see by the way our face looks. What are you doing? Who are you? Where's Keck gone? He was kind of my favorite. Baby, who's this? Q. Oh, Q's old. Nah. All grown up. Where's Keck? Who are you? There's Keck. Adult female, mother was Q, and father was Lutz. Okay, so we still should be Lutz. There's M. And do. Okay. So that's, I guess that's most of them then. Who we got over here? Who are you? Ooh, there he is. Still kicking. Who'd have thought? Okay, guys. <laughs> that is a little bit heartbreaking. That's like my worst thing. Like, when we were going to do this, I was so sad to think. The first generation of apes that we had were going to die. I don't, I still don't know how App died. I really don't. Maybe they were injured on the travel over here or the journey over here. But yeah, if anybody knows why that is, maybe it was just old age or something. But my worst fears were technically realized when <laughs> we've grown up. A lot of them have gotten older now. And I think the next generation means the older generation, which was our phase one or group one, they're going to be gone after that. So the babies of the babies. I guess that's just how life works. But this is where we're going to end it. So if you are enjoying Ancestors, please drop a like on the video if you want more. Subscribe to stay up to date with everything. And like I said in the beginning of the video, guys, I really do hope you have a good start to the year and it's everything you want it to be. Once again, I hope your loved ones, yourself, they're in the best health possible. And I wish you all the success for this year. So thank you once again so much for watching. And I'll see you all in the next one.